The eyes. Nah, Nick, look at my eyes. Oh, yeah, same thing. No. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're okay. done. You're you know done. what? You're done. You know. All right, what's up, guys? So we're in a bit of a different location today. We've got a special video for you guys because I am in Vancouver, uh, and I don't really want to shoot like a normal YouTube video while I'm here. So I've got my friend. Get in here. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> hey! I'm gonna cut all that. <laughs> out. <laughs> uh, my name's Nick. I am um, his friend. As yeah. he's <laughs> so a bit of a background. I am a professional artist, uh, which I don't like to call myself that. And Nick, what do you do? Uh, I study neuroscience. And I work in the hospital. Yeah, so Nick is a huge brain. And a receding hairline. <laughs> so what we're gonna do today, which I think is gonna be really fun, is if we take uh, these TikTok videos, uh, TikTok art challenges, and we try to make a character for Nick. But mm -hmm. there's a catch, okay? Because I only have one iPad. Oh, no, boy thing. So <laughs> what I think would be fun mm -hmm. is if you draw on here for two minutes, okay? Mm -hmm. Based on the prompts in the TikTok video, and I take over for the next minute, and we will interchange back and forth. I like it. All right, down. There are lots of art involved. I like it. Uh, it's probably going to be terrible, but you know, we gotta have faith in our skills, guys. And I'll see after you challenge. The gender is the opposite of your own. Um, I'm a man, so that would be a woman. You're a man, so we're drawing a girl. Hair is short if you have siblings, and long if you don't. I have no siblings, so hair color if you want long. A cat, natural hair color if you want a dog, and both if you have both. I have only if you don't have pets, yeah, yeah. go with your favorite color. Eyes are your favorite color. And clothes match your phone case. Good luck. What is your favorite color? I should say blue. Blue? Yeah, sure. What do you mean? Let's say, let's just All say. Oh, black. I don't know. Uh, no, no, black, is, color. black is not a color. Is it like a, a tealish blue or is it like a like a warm sky blue? You see, Sam, I have no idea what you're talking about. Have you used the iPad before? No, I have not. Okay, so there are some things that I think you should know. So the this is obviously the pencil. You're going to be drawing on the surface with the pencil. So if you draw something and you're like, oh, no, I made a mistake. Okay. What do you do? You use two fingers. You tap on the screen and that's undo. Oh, that's wild. Okay. And then if you're like, oh, I didn't mean to undo that. Let me undo that. Undo. Three fingers. Redo. What do four fingers do? I don't know. All right, Nick, you're going to do the honors. He's got the iPad. We're going to start a timer. I'm going to set it at uh, two minutes. So the first prompt is girl. You got to draw a girl. Oh, that is wow. You got to make sure that, that her face is uh, presentable. That's an eye. Wow. There's two of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that. You're making our character happy. All right. So guys, notice how Nick is holding his pencil really, really far back. You generally want to be a little bit uh, closer to the front if you want better control of your pencils. So don't, so don't, don't be like Nick. Hey, hey. <laughs> this is judgment that I did not ask for. <laughs> Holy, that's some giraffe neck. Right? Six, five, four. You just had to. Oh no! Three, two, one. Stop! So I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to get done in one minute. Let's just give me two minutes too, okay? So two minutes on this. Now, Nick, there are some things that needs fixing here. A lot. First is the neck. Now, uh, what I want you to see is, uh, look at the, what the, what am I? <laughs> There's this tool called liquefy, or you can just push things. See this? Yeah. Wow. We're gonna push that neck up. I'm gonna get rid of some of these face lines. Okay, we're gonna try to make her, uh, at least yeah, a little bit like more human like you might need a little bit more volume on the hair okay, oh, wow. for it to look like a person well, she's been using some uh, shampoo and conditioner she's got good good shampoo good okay. all right the next thing nicholas is the eyes the eyes now nah, nick look at my eyes oh yeah same thing no mm -hmm. so usually uh what you get is a bit more curvature on the upper lid and a little bit less curvature on the bottom lid. Oh. Obviously, it's gonna vary from person to person. Mm -hmm. uh, Nicholas, look at me. You have about the same curvature on the top and the bottom. Oh. I don't have time to add teeth, so. Usually, you don't have to add teeth to your, because if you do this, it's gonna look. Holy, what in the SpongeBob? <laughs> All right. This is a whole new drawing. Unnatural hair color if you want a cat. Natural hair color if you want a dog. You have a cat, so I'm you have cat. to do uh, an unnatural hair color, which is just basically any color that you want. Unnatural hair color. I'm going to start the timer in two minutes. Go, 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 okay. go, 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 go. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. I'm going to do a little bit of an ombre here. Oh, wow. Oh, you're an ombre. Oh, this is going to be fancy. Oh, we forgot to give her years. Yeah, she doesn't want to listen to this conversation anyways. <laughs> Considering we still have to stay unnatural, let's just do some Ronald McDonald stuff here. Oh, look at that. Ooh, okay. okay, I like that, I like that. Oh, there's oh. your timer. There's your timer. Oh, You're okay. done. You're you done. know what? You're done. You know. All right, so the timer for me starts 
now no. <laughs> we're gonna give her a bit of a skull up top you see so you see the brain sits in the cranium it does yes you, you know about the cranium i do yes he knows about the cranium yes. guys so this has to be a little bit bigger because you can't have somebody who uh has a shrunken cranium because then there's neanderthals yeah, exactly next time you draw somebody who doesn't have a cranium remember what nick said <laughs> yeah, neanderthals <no. laughs> while i'm here i'm gonna add a multiply layer and i'm gonna add some shading Okay, Nick, you probably have no idea what this is, but this- You're tapping a lot of things right now, man. <laughs> Look at that highlight. Oh, that's nice. That's looking pretty good, that's eh? Nice. Nicholas. I know what, not bad. Eyes are your favorite color. And mm -hmm. clothes match your phone case. Okay, we won't worry about the clothes right now. Let's just take it one step at a time. The okay. eyes are your favorite color, which is- Blue. Oh, I like so that. So you see, the iris is the part of the eye which is actually colored. So I assume that the outside of the eye would be the colored aspect and you see the darker inside. How did you know this? Uh, you see, I study science. However, she looks demented. I don't know about this. When people say uh, you want to paint the pupil a certain color, that's that's the that's the wrong terminology. The iris is the It's actually aspect. the iris that's the color. She looks like she's very troubled. Okay, you got one second left. Oh, okay. I'm gonna start the timer for two minutes. Mm -hmm. Now you see the eyes look uh, a little bit uh, crazed because you, there's no shading in the eyes. You see with the darker top section? Yeah, now looks... the eyes look a little bit more realistic, yeah. right? And we can add, this is, what, this is what's called a highlight. Because the surface of your eyes are very shiny, this is, you get a highlight on Oh, that looks Ooh. nice, that looks nice. Just that little dot right exactly. there. Exactly, it makes a big difference. All right, Nicholas, I think we gotta give her a skin tone because it seems like we are, Lacking in that department. So uh, I'm gonna add a layer. Oh, you know how to add layers now. Uh, I don't, but I saw you do it. Now, what are your thoughts on drawing on the iPad so far, Nick? I like it. You have a screen protector here that makes it feel like paper. But maybe from a further away, uh, yeah, much better. Let me set my timer on for the skin. Okay. Okay? Oh, I thought that was, where, that was her clothing. Oh, well, we, we... <laughs> See this? There's a bit of a warmer variation in the midsection of the face okay. because there's a bit more flesh. Yeah. The flesh carries the blood. Am I, am I right about no, that? No, you're right about that. Lots yeah. of blood vessels in the face. Now I'm gonna add multiply. Let's what does the multiply tool do? The multiply basically adds a, uh, a layer that darkens what's underneath. So it's very good for shadows. She looks a little cross-eyed now that I'm looking at this closer. So Nick, do you know how to draw a nose? I can do two lines in the shape of a right angle. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh dear lord, that nostril, Nick. Oh yeah, I remember you taught me how to do warm tones about 10 seconds ago, so let's... Yes. Yeah, we'll leave that. Everyone has their blemishes. Oh! Not that much, though. <laughs> I'm uh, failing to see, Nick, what are you what are you trying to do here? <laughs> <laughs> now, you see the issue here, Nick? Okay. Is we're looking at her head on. So when you look at me, how many nostrils do you see? Uh, I see two. Exactly. You've drawn one nostril. <laughs> Okay. But when you look at me from the side, how many nostrils do you see? I see the one. Exactly. So you've given her a profile view nose, but okay. we're looking at her from the front. So that's the problem. So I'm going to flatten oh, these nostrils. No. See? So we can add a dot to the tip. Now look at that. That's a lot better, actually. It pops, doesn't it? So we're going to add a shadow to the bottom. Ooh. Nick, you take over. I think the next thing that we got to cover uh, is the uh, clothing, which is going to be based on your phone case, and your phone case is... Uh, Black. Oh, it's not. Red. Nick, it's oh. translucent. See, when you press lightly with this uh, pen, it actually has a bit of uh, translucent kind of texture. Right. Some some of the colors underneath can actually come through. I do need to get rid of this, though. Oh. This darkened spot. It seems I've created more darkened spots. <laughs> wow, Nick, it seems you have made a lot of uh, splotches here. How do I get rid of these? Oh. No, actually, you know what? Maybe we can work that into the design. Okay, and you know what? Also, because I, um, I... Use your words, Nick, use your words. Oh, what are you gonna do? Something creative? Something a little off the script here. Oh, oh. Ronald McDonald. This is actually nice. She's like a cool McDonald's worker. All right, we're gonna give her a necklace if I have time too. Oh, you're gonna give her a necklace? Okay, that's your timer, Nick. You did a good job this time. Oh, uh, this time. Looks like she's wearing a poncho. Actually, are we gonna get sued? Oh, I don't know who we is either. This is not my channel. Ah, uh, Nick, this is not good. Actually, if I do get sued, we're gonna just... Oh. Yeah, it's gonna be a W. She's gonna be uh, uh, at... McDonald's. McDonald's. <laughs> now, Nick. It's back to you. Since we're almost done with this character, I want you to add some final refinements, maybe okay. some accessories, okay. whatever you think is gonna look good on this maybe character. Maybe some ears. 
Oh, forgot the three, two, one, go. Okay, so Ooh. first thing I'm going to do is I was looking at those eyebrows. I don't think we came to a conclusion with those. Uh, we never fixed the eyebrows. We never did. So I'm going to very quickly. Do we still want to make her angry? Yeah, I'm going to make her angry. I'm going to keep her as angry. So, she's angry because the uh, customers keep asking for the ice cream and the machine is always broken. Oh, yeah. Guys, I used to work at McDonald's for a year. Let me tell you, that machine's never broken. We used to <laughs> want to serve you. See? Wow. These are powerful eyebrows, Nick. Oh, that's a very good placement for the year. You see, anatomically speaking, your ear should be somewhere around your eye. Wow. It's going to be underneath the hair here, so we're going to do a half. Hey, hair. that's good. That's not bad. All right. And wow. Look. I am thoroughly impressed. I was going to say, Nick, you're more artistically inclined than most people that I know. All of Sam's artist friends, you take offense to that. <laughs> you take great offense to that. <laughs> no, wait, that's not what I meant. She is. If she's going to be frowning like this, she needs to have some forehead wrinkles too. Ooh, Nick, you know what you're doing. That's your timer. Oh, uh, <laughs> holy. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> Nick does not know what he's doing. She looks like a 90 year old oh. witch. We got to give her some lips, Nick. She's got to have lips. See that? Lip. Okay. And then here. Another lip. Bottom lip. So usually, you know, if you're drawing a necklace, it should, it should follow the contour of the neck. So the neck is round. Okay. Yeah. So when you have a necklace, it's gonna come I down see. like this, not inwards. Uh -huh. right? Some loose strands to the hair, right? You can you can give it a bit more of a hairy texture. You see that? Oh. I think everything else is just like personal preference, like. But this is actually much better than I expected. Oh, wow, well, he had low expectations going into this, guys. Oh, dude, my expectations. <laughs> Let me tell you, they were all the way down here. Oh. Did you have fun? I did, I especially liked uh, staying true to my uh, my likes, my interests, because you see, guys, look, this morning. Oh, whoa. Oh, we actually went to McDonald's. So you're being inspired by the things that uh, have occurred in your, in your, in real life. Exactly. But yeah, I mean, like, let me know what you guys think of this character so far. Uh, if you guys are proud of Nick, let him know in the comments. I, I, Nick, I am proud of you. I is mostly, let's be honest here. Well, I mean, like, uh. but you were the creative genius behind all of this. Now, let's, uh, what would you name her? Samantha. Not Samantha. That's the first thing that anyway. came to my mind. <laughs> That's not Samantha. Uh, do you have anything to say to the uh, the little artists out there who are trying to draw but are feeling uninspired or uh, feeling or whatever they might be feeling? Uh, no matter what you're going through, you always stick through with the drawing. As you can see here, I stuck through. Trust the process. Exactly. Trust the process. Especially if you have an artist beside you helping you. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you want to see more art content like this, feel free to subscribe. To yeah. my channel and do it or down below or we will hurt but if you want to you know get your hand held by me you know through a process like this like i've done with nick well uh we have skin tutorial on patreon for the month of may uh we have a new topic each month so go check that out nick say <laughs> bye to the babies uh bye babies is that what you call them <laughs> yeah. they are the art babies oh wow <laughs> so we we usually uh what happens on this channel is we have uh the actual video and then in the end, we do like a, like a blooper section where I can be very candid with my... You just I broke my toy. The blooper. <laughs> <laughs> and then we drove around for I must say though, day. I must say though, for those of you guys who are on the West Coast, you guys have really nice ocean air. Like in Toronto, we don't really get that. The mountains are nice because you go from city to mountains in all of about 30 minutes. Yeah, Toronto is like... Flat. Yeah, 30 minutes, all I can do in Toronto if I'm driving is go down Bay Street. Let's be honest, this freaking traffic there is ridiculous. Yeah, I can't really do much there. I mean, you you want to do like something cool, you got to go like three hours away. So uh, I, I kind of like Vancouver for that, but it's a little bit too rainy here. You guys might want to fix that a little bit. Anyways, let's get out of here. Oh, wow. Oh, oh bye, guys. <laughs>